Sita ma'am has to move. Uh, she has kept a class waiting on a Sunday, so we don't want classes to be waiting. We we can definitely kind of um, have her first, and storytelling is definitely very core to our heart. Welcome her to the stage with a great round of applause. So when I say no, you say yes. Okay. The way I say no, you will say yes. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. <laughs> no. Yes. No. Yes. No. <laughs> no. Yes. Wow, there are some people still alive here. Great. Voice. No! Yes! Turn to language through stories. I learned the language, my mother tongue, because I was born in Bombay. And I was brought up there for a while. The second language was Hindi. Third language was Marathi. First language was English. So how can I learn Tamil? Because in English we have very few alphabet of stories from my father, in English and during the day I used to go to school come back in the evening my mother was very happy she was contented because you know she had had a good day she would get us the tiffin and then I'll ask Amma tell me you know what is that story that housefly that forgot its name now the story goes like this where will it go it goes to the calf and it tells in the calf's ears oh calf oh calf what's my name the calf says, how do I know? Ask my mother from whom I drink milk. The mother says, Bleh. how do I know your name? Ask the stick that always drives me. The stick says, ask the creeper that grows around me. The creeper says, ask the pond in which I grow. The pond says, ask that crane whole day who stands on one leg. The crane says, ask the fish that I catch. The fish says, hee 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 hee, ask the net that falls over me. The net says, ask the fisherman who throws the net. The fisherman says, ask the pot in which I collect the fish. The pot says, ask the potter who makes me into a pot. The potter says, ask the mud which I mix with the clay. The mud says, ask the grass that grows over me. By this time, Everywhere this housefly has been going in perena, in perena, in perena. And he, it remembers. Ah! E! That's my name. Right? So this was the story that my mother told me. The housefly. Where did it go to first? To whom? Calf. From calf to the? Cow to? Stick. Stick to the? Creeper to? Pawn to? Crane to? Fish to? Net to? Fisherman to? Pot to? Potter. Potter to? Mud to? Grass to? Horse. How did you remember? So many teachers and principals generate so many things beautiful. Imagination. What did you imagine? The house fly. You imagine the house life. So did you see it as pictures? Yes. yes. How much technologically we have advanced, you know, beyond words. When I am telling a story, you are still imagining. What are we doing in schools today? C-A-L-F, calf. C-O-W, cow. Dictation, 3 out of 10. Because he can't remember the 14 words. So you see how powerful it is when you directly narrate a story and the impact of it which is visual imagination thank you very much you've been wonderful audience you've been wonderful listeners I've been traveling for the past 22 years i touch almost all countries in the world i'm